and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and to everybody on YouTube for some Zed Shen. Gonna be our last deck today for uh, our first day for a rank up weekend. Today and tomorrow, we're gonna be trying to rank up to Masters. Um, so far, pretty good. You know, we've gotten five more wins than we've had losses so far, thanks to mid range Frostbite. That deck's super strong. We're going to be playing another Shen deck, this time with Zed. Y'all may remember this from last weekend. Uh, we played this. I liked it quite a bit. Um, I did decide to take out the Shadow Assassins, as we talked about, and I fit in another Protégé, because that was a card that I really wanted, and a Riposte that can uh, kind of go with our Protégé, our Zed, stuff like that. And then I felt like we needed a little bit of removal. Remember, we had no removal besides Will of Ionia, I guess. And so I took out Concussive Palm, and instead I'm playing one Concerted Strike, one single combat. I played a couple of games with this um, earlier today off stream, and, and that definitely helped out. Um, like my opponent had like a, a Genevieve Velmhard that they gave tough, you know, that one mana tough card. And so Concerted Strike was really nice killing it, which I guess Concussive Palm would have stunned it, but it was really nice getting that Elmhart off the battlefield so like having both of those and single combat can be okay with um, our barriers that our shen can do anyway i think this deck should be pretty strong um, all these challenger units with demacia having barriers is exactly what you want um yeah i'm looking forward to this one all right let's get to it we're gonna go play five games over in ranked and we'll see how we do We'll be doing some more rank up tomorrow. I think we're going to be focusing a lot on the Bannerman Braum deck tomorrow. As far as a rank up deck goes. And then we'll have uh, Meme Tier Monday on Monday. We already got four decks for Meme Tier Monday. Not video, audio. This board is just louder than all the other boards. And I feel like we need to adjust the volume accordingly. So I like leading with Tracker into War Chefs. Always like me some Shen. Um, the Lifesteal Barrier, while it's not bad, especially against an aggro deck, I feel like we could do better. I don't, I don't think I ever want to keep a 4-mana spell. There's a lot of 4-mana spells, a lot of barrier cards. They're pretty interchangeable. You know, we took one out, got a repost. I don't think I'll probably ever keep one of those in a mulligan scenario. Well... Opponent's hand wasn't very good. That wasn't a very good game. I mean, our hand was awesome, right? Like we were gonna curve perfectly. We had Protege, we had Shen. We were definitely winning that game. But I feel I feel bad that I don't know. We'll all right. We won. We'll count it. Maybe depending on how fast these go, we may play six instead of five, depending on how fast these go. We may just play a sixth game because of that. But, I mean, we're definitely going to win that. Okay, Maokai Nautilus is definitely going to be tough. This is this is not the kind of matchup that you want to play whenever you're playing this kind of Demacia deck. Um, yeah, this is a poor matchup. Because we're trying to, like, outgrind them by, like, using all of our challengers and combat and, you know, slowly remove all their stuff. But then they just play... 7 mana 13 13 that just brings a bunch of like 2 mana 7 7s and stuff like that and that makes life difficult because we're not like a true aggro deck where we win really quickly we are more of a grind them down at mid-range deck it's gonna take some time getting through one ones and stuff it's gonna take some time I have a great hand. Dredge Dredgers is the most important card for the deep deck. So they have they have their most important slash best card. Paired with their second best card, Dreadbloom Wanderer. Paired with Vile Feast for my one drop. 
These woods protect their own. We're not dead yet, of course, but they are not making this easy on us. The eye of twilight sees all. We got the ideal start. Corruption everywhere. Over here on the left-hand side, there's this little um, piece of paper or something. If you click that, you can kind of scroll with what cards have been used. They got rid of Atrocity, Devourer, Grasp, and a second Vile Feast. All hunters withering away. You're covered. Duty, selflessness, heavy burdens. Yeah, or you may just be referring to the Mobilitics extent extension. No, my opponent's playing Nautilus. They're just playing just generic keep deck. Just playing very generic deep deck that's had um, pretty perfect one through five curve. It must be done. Really going deep already? Wow, they, they really had a great hand. I mean, the repose was a good draw, and still take that thing out. But I wanted to. They are under my protection. I wanted to use that on the the thing that the life steal was going to get. But now, you know, I'm hoping they just play uh, Nautilus, and we just bounce Nautilus. We have perfect mana for Will of Ionia plus Whiffling Lancer. That repost was such a perfect draw for me. And yeah, now Stand United is a great draw as well. We really had two really great draws back to back. Homeowner! Gifting a sub to Bipolarian. Thank you so much, homeowner. And Bipolarian, welcome to the channel. Getting that sub. This is four out of five. Uno Moss. One more sub for that extra gameplay. You know, just spread, spreading the wealth. Don't need to do the barrier on the thing that was already big. Spreading the wealth. Jeez. So real impressive how we took down their best hand. Like how does Everything their hand doesn't get better than that, right? Like the at least the first five turns does not get better. Um, I guess I guess you could argue a better turn five than just playing the the five mana three three elusive. That repost really did save me. That was that was the draw that completely changed that game around. That repost. Okay, we're going to mulligan repost because it was so good for me. But like I said, I just never gonna keep a four mana spell. Because there there's just so many four mana spells, they're interchangeable. Draw another one. Yeah, their turn six wasn't good. The turn six was where, you know, I'd had the repost, which was perfect. They basically did nothing. 
spent their turn going deep. That was really where we won that game. Okay. We're going to double spell with those two. Uh, we'll take that. We just traded that tough card for nothing. That's a good, useful spell. And basically, they just spent one spell. You know, they just turned that into a three-one. Right? Looking for trouble? It found you. Certainly, considering Will of Ionia and just bouncing. Strike and grace, beauty in the play. Yeah, so I take I take four. Where are you at? One out of four? All right, that's fine. Eh. Probably should do this just to be even more safe. All right, get out of here. Place Spirits Refuge and base so basically I'll trade Spirits Refuge and Greenglade Caretaker and kill the Great Horn Companion and not let them attack again, and then I would be able to go straight to combat after that. Or I take a whole lot of damage. Ugh. Tough card, and they just didn't use it to save their five five. Nope. The answer there is nope. Do not fear the shrouded path. Harry, report. You are tough. Hmm. All right, so this is me attacking for 12. Maybe I should, I do two less damage. I should probably pump, pump this up though and just put this thing at being a, a five two. Yeah, I didn't have the mana to play my 5-4. Ah, to 
Jen. All right, so if I go straight to attacks, you know, my two four challenges, the three one, this pumps this up, so we have six, seven, eight, nine. We have nine, it's not lethal. Yeah, there, yeah, that was a good one drop for them. That worked out. That was, it's definitely better. You know, that was that was a good exchange for them. Do that. Do that. Just trades with war chefs. Yeah, that was a good one drop. Create that Legion Grenadier. Yuck. Alright, so they have a Demacia card on top. Good draw. I hope that was... Yeah, I guess that was their card on top, wasn't it? Get for playing failure cards. Let's go. Without a sound. Hope their bilge water cards not twisted fate. Let's go, Zed. I three no. With honor. Got him. Zetchen. Um, I want to. I, I like playing against Demacia decks. I like. I, I kind of like us in Demacia matchups because we have the barriers and things like that. We got all these challengers and barriers and stuff. That's what I want to be facing. Sweet. We just mulligan five mana card. That's a good one. Caretakers are a little awkward for now. I'll write my own story. I'll do my best. Will you? I like having another protector, that's good. We just top decked the protector. Definitely didn't have it before. I'm getting in your way. You're late. You are early. Who does not know the name Laurent? No one. Everybody knows the name Laurent. So this is awkward because. My best play is playing Green Glade Caretaker, Green Glade Caretaker, Bright, Bright Steel Protector. But if I do that, I can't, I can't kill both Lucian and Senna. I need War Chefs to be able to kill one of them. Which I guess maybe that means I go War, you know. So then I'm thinking War Chefs and Protector, but then I just don't get like the bonuses on these Green Glade Caretakers. So that's a little awkward.
just a bad play against the one mana tough card. It's not that bad. It's fine. It's basically the exact same thing that was going to happen. Like, they just... Like, we just used a single... All they did was turn that single combat into a 3-2. Like, I was going to end up with a 2-1 challenger and, and my other challenger dead. So they just they just turned single combat, which is a super valuable card, into just a 3-2. And that is really not very valuable. So that's a pretty great trade for us. Hmm. If they just attack with Grizzled Ranger... Why did I do warships? I should've done the I should've done this thing. I should've done this bright seal protector. I don't know why I did warships. I should've done the bright seal protector. I don't want to trade both of my 5-2s for both of their cards. I'll trade one 5-2 away. I wish they would have done that on the 5-2. Our other 5 2 for the 3 4. Hey, Genevieve Elmhart. I kind of My forgot about you. It's been a little bit. How you doing? Hmm. Probably better than I am right now. Looking at their Genevieve Elmhart. Play the war chefs. Love it. Great card. The quiet of the woods. There's nothing like it. Good card to draw. Yeah, right. Dude, Garen Board is such epic music. 7-3. It's a 3-7. I don't know why I'm saying 7-3. I'm thinking of health first. Okay. Um, 4-8... Alright, so two ways to go about this. I go repost and kill them, or I go repost and kill Siren. If they have if they have single combat.
Yeah, it's go go for lethal or. I mean, I guess like single combat's about the only thing they can have, and. If they do have single combat, I'm in a lot of trouble. I guess I'm not in that much trouble. Wait. Wait, sing single combat doesn't save him. Right, because that's gonna be that's gonna be four health. I forgot that that was going to four health. And so yeah, we can go here, and now single combat doesn't save him. Wait, I was, I was thinking that we had the, th the two three healths and we weren't gonna be able to protect both of them. But then I realized that, yeah, that wasn't. Because then, then I looked and I was like, wait, isn't isn't the War Chefs supposed to pump that up? And why is that just a 4-3 with the War Chefs pump? And then I realized, oh, wait, War Chefs pump hasn't happened yet, so that's going to go to 4 health and we can repost the other one. Took me a second. Y'all at home are probably saying, just repost that one. You don't have to worry about single combat. And took me a second. Yes, yeah, so there's there's the deck list right there. JX the code, just click on that. The code's on the right hand side. Yeah, we didn't have to have the hype boat <laughs> slash siren die. That is good. Didn't have to have that die. All right, and the control deck for our last one to try to get the five zero. This could be a difficult matchup for sure. Control decks are good. Kind of want to keep all of these. What's our play gonna look like? Turn one tracker, turn two caretaker. Um, Castle Mulligan those. And honestly, I don't, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to keep the caretaker. Well, now I'm glad we kept caretaker with having another one drop. Cause might have been possible that I was supposed to look for a two drop to be able to play. I am one with the land. Beam the one two. Rats, Mystic Shot the one two. That's one less Mystic Shot for the Zed. I'm just curving out. We're just going to play our stuff. They want to kill things, they can kill things. If they don't, cool. Man, this is... I mean, I could just go to attacks and we're definitely getting that other attacker. But they, if they had removal for Zed, they could have used it last turn. I think it's worth it. Like, their deck doesn't play that much stuff that... Yeah, like, see, like, they could have just bounced that anyway after I attack. We Still got the same number of damage in, but now we also have the Shen starting to level up. Don't have it. No, don't have Flash of Brilliance. Only thing that can keep them alive, Flash of Brilliance. Just play Get Excited. Get Excited. Get Excited. Get Excited. Get Excited. Okay, well, just tap them out. They'll hit me for nine. The dragon remembers.
Duty, selflessness, heavy burdens. Vi, stand for vicious. Get out of here, Vi. You're not vicious. You're gone. GG's, that's a 5 0. Let's go. You fought with honor. Okay, got another 5 0 there with Zed Shen. I uh, think, you know, adding in adding in that little bit of removal, that was that was clutch, you know, like we saw that single combat come in clutch there, taking down that Heimerdinger. Um, you know, I, I, I think these were some good changes, and I'm sorry, Shadow Assassin, but you left. But, you know, like the repost, we, we multiple times drew like a clutch repost and getting a third repost in instead of the Shadow Assassin. So basically, last time we had two Shadow Assassins, and those turned into the third protege and the third repost, because we had two of all of those. And then we had two concussive palms, and that turned in, that went from uh, single combat and concerted strike, and I liked those as well. Whoa, homeowner gifting out another sub. Thank you so much, homeowner. That gets us to our sub goal. We'll play some bonus games here. We'll play some bonus games with both of these decks. Um, yeah, we'll we'll be doing that. All right, so yeah, another 5-0 here with Zed Shen. Pretty awesome. Um, yeah, decks decks really really good. Yeah, I like I like this one. I think this is this is like a you know this is like really how Shen is supposed to be used with a whole bunch of challengers that Shen can pump up. Um, so uh, yeah, this really takes full advantage of Shen. And even though we don't have any card draw, we have a lot of hidden card advantage with um, with like these challengers with barriers that take out things and don't die. Um, you know, that's a hidden hidden card advantage. You know, like whenever we put, you know, Protector, the Fleet Feather Tracker, and then the Fleet Feather Tracker kills one of their things. You know, that's that's basically like drawing a card. We're removing one of their cards without spending any of ours. Agent Iowa going, heck yeah, bonus games. Thank you, Agent Iowa. Um, you know, uh, Swiftwing Lancer, of course, uh, generates another random elite. So that's some card advantage. Elmheart usually takes out two. Um, cards at least. So there's a lot of hidden card advantage in here. You know, usually they just throw something in front of Zed so Zed doesn't level up. Um, so you know it's hidden, but it's in there. All right, that's it here for Zed at Shen. Those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. And of course, feel free to leave those comments as well. So we're halfway there. We talked about how at the very beginning of the day, we were 17 wins away from Masters. A long ways seven we need to win 17 more games than we lost because every loss knocks you down one so today uh the two three and the three two cancel each other out and so then we have 10 with the two five o's we have 10 more wins than we have losses so we are only seven away now for tomorrow gonna try to knock that out we'll play a couple more here off stream we'll see if we get any closer all right let's play some bonus games Keep playing this one. I, I really like this one. We'll play we'll play one here. You know, we got the mid-range frostbite also. We're gonna play those for a little bit. Yeah, planning on just going through I was yeah, that was the plan, is just go through diamond today and tomorrow. Tomorrow we're gonna be focusing on the Bannerman Braum deck quite a bit. And honestly, I should probably play a practice game with that. See if we you know, see what we would need to change with that. I was gonna be doing uh a singular rank up de deck day with the Bannerman Braum. <laughs> Always like random comments. All right, playing against Misfortune Lucian again. And we will keep this hand again. <laughs> Brommer Man. That's Bannerman Brom. Just call it Brommer Man. It's kind of like Bomber Man. What's Bomber Man from? Isn't that's like a Nintendo game, right? Bomber Man. I think it's a Nintendo game. I think. These woods protect their own. Was it like like original Nintendo? Break their spirits and 
and their swords. I don't quite remember. Yeah, I know it's old school. Original Nintendo. What do you do in Bomberman? Okay, yeah, it wasn't necessarily made by Nintendo, but it was on Nintendo. Worth. So they just traded that spell to just get a 2-1. That's that's definitely really annoying. Uh My shield is yours. Time to get rowdy. Love you. We're gonna take some damage. But our next turn is going to be great. I'll stop you. Mwah. really good for them. Show back. Nothing back. Here we go. Will of Ionia being great again. Come on, draw barrier. Barrier. Darn. So, like, I could attack out, and we could do 17 damage to them. And maybe that was just the way I should go, is just do 17 damage to them. That's a lot of damage. The ocean charts our course. Their pride will cost them. Hmm. Looks like that's what I should have done. Got a tie. Got a... A black and red tie on. Steady my hand. Why is that in their deck? Oh, maybe your conservator created that. Alright, good 20 damage. One mana, eight threes. They didn't have another unit that cost three or less. That's just that four drop. And I'm glad I didn't just like attack out with everything, so I would have would have lost that.
Like, we're going to be playing this very similar deck a bunch tomorrow. Um, I don't know. Like, we're, we're on this winning streak. I feel like I shouldn't change decks. You know, why, why put the deck down if we haven't lost? Okay. So this is okay, this is the new deck for Nenuel. Alright, I'll just see what I can do. Well, it's a rough hand. against Noxus. <sighs> no two drop. Or three drop. So I could attack with both and then just fear its refuge one and then, you know, it's basically, like, I could turn this... Basically, I could turn this into Brothers Bond plus Barrier. That's not too bad. Sure, let's do that. Okay, I just said no blocks. It's Draven time. That's not. Just basically doing this because now I have four mana. If I wait till next turn, I'll only have I'll have seven mana, so I'll be able to play like a, a four drop, and then that's it, and, and so on. So that extra mana, pretty important. Well, right on. I walk the space between worlds. Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping to really win, like, by the time, like, they recall Draven and create another axe, like, I'm hoping to kind of win before that stuff helps too much. And yeah, like, if they want to, if they want to use both spinning axes and discard two cards and turn Draven into a 5-3 to kill Shen, oh well. It's more likely they have, like, Transfusion, but still, you know, like, we're... Or hopefully eating their 6-4 for free. love to have protege on turn three how we cast will of ionia you know like i would have loved to have like one of these two proteges back on turn three but you don't always get what you want Rather save Concerted Strike for large unit.
We'll have six cards over there. That was the best thing they could possibly have. That Noxian Fervor, that was... That was the best they could have. I don't think I beat Harrowing. I just don't I just don't think I do. I just hope they don't have Harrowing. Less units than I thought. I did get less stuff than I thought they would get. That doesn't seem too bad. Not as bad. He'll be back. He's too stupid to die. You're even out. Right, down to seven. Today we turn the tide of war. A lot of options here of like go straight to attack with I mean I don't think I just go straight to attack with both you, you know like do I play another Genevieve Elmhart okay I definitely am playing another Genevieve Elmhart now so now do I play like protege first and then Genevieve To have protege be three power. That three power could matter. Likely won't, because protege will just challenge something, so probably won't. With me. Hoping they just play another unit, just one unit that taps them out. Three mana unit. It's close. Please don't have a one drop, no one drop, no one drop. Pass, pass, pass. Yes. Okay. 7 0. Exact lethal. Exact lethal. Whew. That was close. Genevieve Elmhart, awesome.
There's some good games. <laughs> yeah, no kidding, right, homeowner? We had we had a rough about like three, four days in a row there. Cause we were about yeah, it was about three or four days ago. I was one win away from Masters, and then we went all the way down to having zero wins in Diamond. <laughs> very very quickly. Karma Ezreal. Very quickly. Hmm. I'm gonna go with Caretaker against against Karma as. These woods protect their own. They can't have you know like thermogenic beam doesn't kill that. And now we just have this three two, so they can't Mystic Shot and kill. They can't kill my Caretaker. Take six. Awesome. And six is more than five. The order rewards its faithful. Going for the high upside, the safer play, cool. The safer play was just to play the Bright Steel Protector immediately. I'm not letting them kill that caretaker. Next turn we'll have repose to protect caretaker. Okay, all right, Potato. Gangplank with Farron. I'll, oh, Captain, my Captain. Okay. How How is Gangplank and Farron together? Okay, because Captain... Because Farron is Captain Farron. Is Gangplank like a captain of a ship? Turn four GG. Turn four GG. Eight-o. We just had an opponent that played all of their mana but one on turn four. By turn four. They spent nine out of their ten mana they could spend, and they died on turn four. <laughs> Alright, so Gangplank Farron. Alright, this one's not going to go nearly like the other one. I can't imagine. Yeah, that was turn four. Man, I wish I wish I was still rolling recording for YouTube. I mean, I guess I could I could still record. I could record all of this for YouTube. I could go back and record like the VOD. Um, we could still do that. I wonder if this time I want to lead with Tracker. I don't believe the tracker this time. No, this is worse against Thermogenic Beam. Okay, cool. But attacks for more. Go, Captain. My Captain. Head to the base and fight on an empty stomach. Cool. One last Mystic Shot for Zed. The order rewards its faithful. Do 
Love drawing that riposte for the Zed. Oh, I love Prismatic Barrier even more. So that means I could get to play Caretaker also. And I'm gonna have War Chefs pump up Caretaker to give it to get it above Shadow Assassin. We each hold a world within. You cannot escape. That was a good card for them to have. You don't see very many jury rigs these days, but that worked out for him. Opponent's playing Karma Ez. So that gives them the second spell, so they'll get a Dragaling, so they get to gain two life with the Dragaling. They just discarded a Karma and a Will of Ionia, I guess. Don't blink, or you miss me. These woods protect their own. Watch and learn. Within my grasp. Everything needs to be nerfed. Epic music that we're playing. That's what it is. Epic music. Yeah, Challenger. Challenger is very good against elusives. Yeah, especially Scout Challenger. Yeah. Especially Scout Challenger, but just in general, usually Challengers generally good against elusives. All right, last one. We're going for the 10 0. Here we go, last one. Okay. This Yasuo can definitely be really difficult because we don't play much removal, you know, like, all, like our removal is Challenger. So love that we have the single combat. But. Then again, we also have to have something large enough that would kill Yasuo. That's not easy either. Do I mulligan single combat? Try to curve out. Yeah, I mean, I like this. All right, what are we leading with? Leading with Caretaker. Caretaker attacks for six. Tracker attacks for five. This line's better against Fae Blade Twirler. 
they just ain't blocking with, with the blade twirler. The order rewards its faithful. Hmm. Skarzig with the raid! What's up? Thank you, Skarzig. Welcome, welcome y'all from Skarzig's stream. We are playing some Shen. We are currently 9-0 with this Zed Shen deck. We just kept winning, so we decided to keep playing. You know, finishing up the stream. This is the tough call. Shen... Or Protector Tracker. We'll go, Shen. If they don't have Yasuo, we're going to be doing great. Just please don't have Yasuo. Please don't have Yasuo. Please. Please. The Built. Will decide your fate. It can try. Uh, it can try. Mm -mm. So let's see. I challenge here. It must be done. I go here. They can't kill any of my four things. I mean, well, they can kill the five two without have to be Yasuo. Likely Yasuo block Shen. They take eight. Or, okay, they're going to sacrifice that thing too. Have their one scary card. Shen's really good. So next turn we'll have six mana. Hmm. That's not bad. Ah, no, I still can't play. I can't play all four of these. So what am I not playing? Am I just not going to play the Green Glade Caretaker? So basically, I can... Hmm. Really wish I could go Caretaker and... Bright Seal Protector and <laughs> Prismatic Barrier. But I guess I shouldn't expect to be playing four spells on turn six. Even though I wanna. Work for work. Fast Don't let the fluffy tails fool you.
Yeah, we're 9-0, but they have Yasuo. So that definitely makes things problematic. So they, they probably want to stun or bounce the protege, right? Because they want to keep the Yasuo alive. So um, like if they bounce it, it'll turn back into a 2-4, which is nice. So we'll just have these take take those out. The Blade Twirler will go into a 3 health. Oh, Transfusion and Stun? Oh man, that was really good having the two spells. Ouch. Wasn't expecting two spells like that. Yeah, we're we're doing okay still. We're doing just fine. I mean, we have. We have one less card in hand than they do. Darn, would have loved to draw a spell. Got there. All right. Didn't want to let, you know, can't let them play like another Yone or anything like that. Got to go straight to attacks. Against the Yasuo deck, you basically always got to go straight to attacks because of, you know, Yone and they could have Arachnoid Sentry and all that kind of stuff. All right. Got the 10-0. Cool. So there we go. So now we are um, two wins away from masters and uh we'll do that tomorrow so yeah we'll just take the we'll take the 10 and go home <laughs> yeah we need a 10 wins emote we just have our our five wins emote <laughs> we just just gotta double those up there you go double five win dream yeah there you go ran danny had it with the plus okay um yeah, we'll save that for Rank Up Sunday. We'll save that, Masters, for tomorrow. All right, um, I guess I'm going to go back through, and I'm going to go to the, the Twitch, um, you know, um, uh, video library, and I'm going to go re-record this whole thing, and so we can get the, we get the rest of these on, and we'll just put this whole thing up for YouTube, because this was pretty epic games that we had in there. Um, we had a turn four kill, by the way, those of y'all that just joined us, like from um, from uh, the raid, uh, from Scarzig or you know anything, we did. Have